So it is September 5th, Tuesday, and this is my warm-up this morning and before my art session on a larger piece I'm working on. Um, I don't even think this was a 10-minute warm-up, but again, I'm in my Strathmore mixed-media journal. Um, some people call them sketchbooks, some people call them art journals. Um, I've never called mine a sketchbook because I don't, I feel like I don't draw. So some of the things I'm using are Derwent ink tents blocks, um, Karin Dash Neo colors. <coughs> um, I've moved on to some watery fluid acrylic that's golden uh, using my stabilo pencil to come in and make some more marks Bringing in some color. This is kind of a blue green color that I am favoring. It's a blick paint. Um, I really like it in my um, art journal for some reason. I've been using quite a bit of it though. Um, I mix it with um, some other paints and I mix it sometimes with gesso. I just, for some reason, have been really fond of the color lately. Uh, blues and greens have been really speaking to me. I did a little splatter there. I feel like I was probably thinking um, about... Um, abstract landscape based on the <clears throat> line across both pages. Coming in with my little blotting paper and trying to mop up some of the extra liquid. I'm really obsessed with that blotting paper actually. I'm admiring it there. Bringing in a little bit of wax pastel. Some little blue marks, lines. I feel like I could do these little sketch, you know, art journal sketchbook. I could just have 10 books and just do 10 of them in a row and let them all lay there and dry. I feel like I could just keep, keep after it. They aren't really representative of any place or anything. Um, but I kind of like working across the line that would be a horizon line. I just don't know that I have the whole, um, that's a Faber-Castell marker. I just don't know that I have the whole landscape uh, thing figured out yet. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe it's just that I'm too tough on myself. It is interesting, though, to watch yourself paint um, and create and draw and scribble. It's uh, probably as big of a surprise for me as it is for you guys.
feel like bringing that blue in was something I really ended up liking because I think at the end I give you the thumbs up, the blue-green. A little more splatter. I'm such a hot mess when I splatter. I splatter and I end up wearing half of it. I'm really, really a messy, messy painter. And I do like coming back in and doing commentary at the end because I feel like it. I can give a little bit more of a perspective on what's happening than when I'm actually doing it feels easier to me for some reason. Alright. Feels like I'm almost at the end. I'm giving it the old tapping fingers. I'm trying to hit the spots that aren't really wet. I really like the teal. Maybe I'll come back to this page tomorrow and add to it. I'm not sure why, but I do like it. I think I like the color combination. All right, I think this is a stopping point because I'm about to give the thumbs up. Yep. See you guys later. Thanks.